of um, Blake Peterson and the mathematician I chose for this project is John Venn. So John Venn was English and he was born in Hull, England in August 4th, 1834 and he died in Cambridge, England on April 4th, 1923. His mother, Martha, died when he was a boy. And his father, Reverend Henry Venn, was a was a fellow of the Queen's, which basically meant he was part of like the royal family, probably. Um, he lived in the Romantic era, so he lived through both of the World Wars. And the men that the fashion firm men was, they would wear high collars with long coats, loose around the waist, and close fitting pants. And the what the women wore was double flounced skirts. He had some achievements, which was he had three books, which were two of them were published and he wrote one. And the two that he published were Symbolic Logic in 1881 and the Principles of Imperial Logic in 1889. And he wrote the history of his college, Gonville and Caius College, 1939 through 1897. He was elected part of the Royal Society. He got a scientific doctorate from Cambridge University. And the most important one that we will be discussing is the Venn diagram. So the Venn diagram was created by John Venn. They usually contain two or more ellipses to compare and contrast two or more data sets that are prevented, presented. Here are an example of the two have two of many kinds, and there is some some examples that we use for a problem in um, one of our lectures, intro to sets, and here's one of them. An example we used was a college had an undergrad graduate enrollment of 3,500 students. Recent statistics show that 1,800 860 are business majors and 1,800 are women. Of the business major, 425 are women. Then, in conclusion, John Venn lived through the 18 and 1900s, the Romantic era. He was a successful author and publisher. He created the Venn diagram that we use today. It was, he was very influential in math and science, and he was awarded for all of his achievements. Here's my work cited. Thank you. Have a good day.